Welcome to the Crypto Teacher. And guys, please like and subscribe if you do like what you're listening to. Please inform your friends and family. It's a very imperative time we get back to learning finances and understand how the world really works. Because once we understand how the world really works, we understand that everything is planned out. So therefore, you don't fall for the same tricks. Now, I want to thank those who purchased the book, Crypto Teacher and W.O. Book. Also, those who donated to the uh, Patreon and Cash App, much love. Now, guys, of course, we want to get into cryptos first. Uh, basically, of course, we have Bitcoin right now stable. As we can see, the stable coins are stable. Remember when we under 99, and remember we, we're looking at all the stable coins, not just Tether. Now, uh, some important news as far as with uh, USDC, we saw uh, Justin Sun sent out a tweet that I think they're like $2.5 billion. So guys, they're putting it right in front of our face. The stable coins are basically the liquidity. Same way, of course, the dollar is with the stock market. As we can see, the stock market is just heading up. While all this chaos, people out of work, chaos, it just keep ticking up. I think it hit 26000 a day. So, But when we look at the Bitcoin plunge, I told everybody what will happen, BitMEX and CME. You saw what BitMEX did, guys. Arthur Haynes sent out a tweet and said uh, we should be headed to 15000 A few hours later, what happens? We plunge. Guys, the game to them. There is no, you know, regulation in this. They can do whatever they want to do. So, guys, their job is to take your money. That's how they get paid. They want volatility. That's how they get paid. So, definitely get in the game. So, therefore, you're trading. You're making money. When you're trading, you don't care whether it go up or down. You just want the volatility. Now, of course, we have uh, Coinbase with uh, USDC because, of course, that's their stable coin that they carry. They dropped their interest rate, I think it was like one point, I forgot what the exact amount, but they did drop it like 90%. Um, also, of course, Coinbase went down with all this trading. As you know, it's all a game, guys. You know, it's all a game. Basically, they went down at the same time where you're supposed to be making money. Of course, they go down. And after they said they fixed the issue. Uh, but we also have uh, the OMG network. We have Bitfinex going to be using that, so using that platform. We have the Chinese uh, currency, of course, their digital currency is ramping up. Also, later in this video, I'm going to get into, of course, they're going to be selling treasury. That's going to be very, very important. Uh, but going into Repl, which is, you know, uh, connecting the dots, guys. And like I said, I said this in my previous video. Of course, Goldman Sachs has been holding MoneyGram stock. So, of course, if uh, Western Union buys MoneyGram, that means that Goldman Sachs gets the cash out. Guys, the same hands owning everything, guys. It's, it's just nothing but a game. We have to make sure that we'll wake up to this. So, therefore, money is easy to be made. We're not busting our butts uh, to make money. It's right there in our hands. We're in the perfect space where it's small. Nobody knows about it. The masses are distracted. Only thing you gotta do is sit back, learn the fundamentals, learn the dates. Remember, BitMEX, CME, their contracts start on the fifth, so therefore they need Bitcoin in order to buy these, you know, derivatives and all that good stuff. So guys, look at the dates, understand when the money is moved in, understand when the money is moved out. Keep focus on the stable coins. XRP now is one of our new indicators, also the volume. So, guys, this is definitely your time, especially if you're a young guy. You have time to sit around, especially if you're out of work. This is your time to study and get in the game. Now, getting over to um, the stock market, and uh, basically, just like I stated, the stock market hit 27000 We have China uh, basically stated they're going to sell treasuries. Now, of course, when they start selling treasuries, they're unloading the debt, which makes, of course, the dollar weaker. And the fact is that when they're going over to their digital currency, they have, I think it's 60 countries already pegged to their yuan, which is not public to anybody. You have to go do your research. I put that in this video. So the, so the fact is that basically if they can get you know all those countries over there with the belt attached to there, they would replace the U.S. dollar. So all these countries that are pegged to the U.S. dollar will be pegged to the yuan. So now you, now you can see the pieces... Um, you know, unfolding. Now, we had Wells Fargo halt 
um, loans to these car loans, guys. A car is collateral. Like that's the easiest money you can make because basically you can keep reselling the same car over and over and over again. No, they're coming out because they know the people are not going to have the money. So guys, wake up to this. Get your friends and family into finances. So therefore they understand the game is changing. Anytime they stop giving loans to something that's collateral, guys, we know that the game is changing and they know it's changing. Remember, 85% of the stock market is owned by the top 10%. That's why it keeps going up with this chaos. People don't own it. People not focused on it. Stay focused on your money. Turn the television off because that's what they want you to do. Just like Anthony Sutton stated, they're managers of what? Conflict. They never want to solve a problem. They just want to manage the conflict. That's why you have the divide and conquer. Black against white. Gay versus straight. Democrat versus Republican. They have to have the yin and the yang, guys. That's how they keep the system going. That's how they keep control. You have to understand this. Now, uh, basically, uh, we have um, Mexico with their cartels. Guys, anytime you see operation, if you see operation in front of anything, that means the government. So, Operation Blue Agave, basically they had uh, locked down a billion dollars worth of cartel money. Getting into the uh, more into the stocks. Uh, we have Zoom stock went up. When I said the at-home stocks, Canopy growth stocks are going up. Tilray going up. We know these weed stocks are going to be going up because, of course, when people are depressed, what they do, they drink and they smoke weed. Uh, basically, the uh, Apple, of course, their stores will be getting looted. They're tracking these phones. So remember, guys, they can track you when it's off. So uh, understand that basically we're definitely moving over into the technology phase. You see that this whole system is fake. Stock market is going through the roof with all this crazy is going on. If that doesn't open your eyes up, nothing will. But guys, that's all I have for you. Don't forget about the books, Crypto Teacher and W.O. book, The Cryptos, Coinbase, Bitchu, Binance. Also, guys, your stocks never, ever bet against the banks. Also, we have, uh, of course, Cobalt Gaming. Gaming is going to be huge. Chip stocks, everything is going to have a chip in it. Uh, basically, everybody's sitting at home. Don't forget about those stocks, the C word, the biotech stocks. And remember, because everybody's sitting at home relaxing, what are they doing? They're drinking, they're smoking weed. Don't forget about those stocks, and y'all have a wonderful day.